we've got junior world team member and senior world team member Kamal Bay at the OTC. You're out here training. Just talk about what the last few weeks have been like for you guys. Went to training camp in Oregon, back out here. Uh, the last two weeks for me has been a, a real big improvement on just me. And uh, I feel that the strength and conditioning camp it helped me get my lungs right. It helped me get my, my strength back and, you know, help me develop size because you never want to go into like to a tournament, you know. And, uh, yeah, I've just been uh, working in the development, uh, becoming more fearless, you know, going out there trying new things that uh, that usually I'm uncomfortable with. And I used to say all the time, you got to be comfortable being uncomfortable. But uh, in the wrestling world, you know, there's going to be so many different things, so many different challenges, so many different positions you're going to be in and encounter that, uh, you know, you just want to be, you want to prepare the best you can for any occasion is what I'm trying to get to. And uh, I definitely feel uh, the Oregon camp helped me uh, learn a lot more about my teammates and learn a lot more about myself. You're a little over a month out from Junior Worlds. What's the mental approach going in? You have got to defend your title. Is there any pressure there? Uh, no, there's no pressure at all. Uh, it's, uh, for me, just another tournament. You know, it's a big tournament. I want to win it. Uh, I want to share that win with uh, my coaches, you know, my family, you know, my teammates. But uh, it's the same approach as I went in the last uh, two years that I've been there. And that's, uh, I'm just going to wrestle to the best of my ability. And uh, at the end of the day, I'm going to know that I gave 100% and nobody can take that away from me. A month after that, you'll be um, heading to Senior Worlds. Is there one to you that, that carries a little bit more weight or a little bit more importance or something that you're focusing on more? Uh, I consider them all the same. After I win a big tournament or something, I just say on to the next one. You know, so uh, Senior Worlds, I'm excited. You know, it's my first time going to Senior Worlds. You know, uh, wrestling, what people compare as the you know the next level after Junior Worlds. So I'm ready to see the strength, I'm ready to see the speed, I'm ready to see the technique. But I'm also ready to show the world me. What's, what do you think is going to be the key for you to stay fresh and to stay ready to go between those two tournaments? I mean, we have a pretty good plan. For me personally, I know what I have to do. Uh, my coaches Herb and Ike know what I need to do. So uh, I'm just going to pretty much at the Junior Worlds uh, just, you know, stay in the wrestling shape, work on my technique development, keep my conditioning up. And the point is, like, to make it all fun, you know. You never want to uh, feel stressed out. You never want to make it feel like a burden when you're out there competing, you know, traveling and training. So, uh you know, just like keeping it fun, you know, keeping it loose, like, you know, get the best workout I can get in the moment. Um, got quite a few new guys on our senior team, um, you included. Can you just talk about the team and, and the, um, the chemistry so far? Uh, I feel like uh, the chemistry of the team has developed a lot more since Oregon camp. Uh, I remember when I first got there, uh, I was sitting in the back with uh, John Jay, and he looks at me and he tells me, come on, I absolutely think we have nothing in common. And I was like, are you sure about that? I'm like, why don't we just start talking, we see where it goes and stuff. And uh, after our conversation, we both found out that, you know, we like uh, Chance the Rapper, we both do yoga, uh, we both like nature, but, you know, we'd rather be in the city. But, you know, it's stuff like that that uh, really helps uh, develop a team. You know, we played a lot of games together, Mafia, you know, video games together and everything, ran together, you know. Uh, you become uh, so much closer, you know, through adversity. And uh, that's mainly, mainly the focal point of uh, the Oregon camp, waking up at 7 a.m., having to run uh, miles. I don't do that. <laughs> You're going to work out? <laughs> I hate running with a passion, but my, my coach, Momir Pelkovich, told me that if I want to be world champ, I'll have to do things I don't want to do. So I'm out here running miles. I'm eating broccoli, doing a lot of things I don't want to do to, uh, to push myself further and beyond. So... <laughs> So I think the last time we saw you was um, was Pan Am's internationally at least, and you suffered an injury there. Can you talk about the recovery process and kind of how you're feeling now? Uh, yeah, the Pan Am Games was uh, it was sad because uh, well, year previous I couldn't wrestle because I had a concussion. This year I get to wrestle, but I end up uh, tearing cartilage in my rib. Uh, the healing process it didn't take as long as they said it would take because you know I, we have great uh, doctors here at the training staff. Corey our trainer, he took uh, good care of me, got me what I need. Uh, but it was just everybody who uh, kept believing in me, kept telling me to you know, do the right things, eat the right things, and uh, take my medicine, which helped me uh, get back to where I am. And then I ended up winning uh, World Team Trials to make the senior team. So I'll say, you know, like it's adversity, you know, you got to get through it. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. And anything you're working on or any, um, yeah, any, any plans between now and, and, and juniors, any changes in schedule, that kind of thing? Uh, just developing my technique and stuff. Uh, we have a Chilean coach here who's been uh, – who's been working with me a lot, and uh, he's helped improve my game a lot more positions. And uh, like I said, just wrestling out of positions that 
uh, most people are uncomfortable in wrestling out of, you know, like uh, never giving up a point easily, uh, fighting out of everything, and uh, focusing on my uh, my breathing in, uh, in uh, tough situations, you know, like when you're out there and you're wrestling and now you're caught and you know you're just stressing, you know, you're flexing your muscles and stuff, but you're not breathing and stuff, and that, that, uh, that'll hurt you more than anything because you're not giving your body the oxygen it needs to, uh, to push through it. So yeah, just focusing on uh, little things, little tweaks, just to get my body and myself ready. Awesome, thanks, Ma. Mm, no problem.